Well, what is up, YouTubers? It's Mushrooms Toy Box, and here we have. Um, I know I have a voting video where I'm asking people to tell me which uh, figures to build. However, um, this came in yesterday, and I really wanted to get to building it immediately because um, it's one of the, my favorite games that I've been playing uh, lately. So uh, basically, uh, I ordered online and I got the Clash of Clans uh, minifigure set from China. Okay, the company is called, hold on, I think it's called Shenzhang or something like that. Uh, and it's the world minifigures. Um, and these are, like I said, the Clash of Clans video game. I don't, I don't know if you guys play Clash of Clans on uh, your phones or anything, but it's a really fun game and it totally is what I've been wasting a lot of my time with. So I wanted to do a quick video of it to show you these awesome figures ASAP. Hold on one sec. All right, so basically uh, it's just a six figure set and I paid, I think, five bucks for these. They were delivered free of charge from China, um, from Rose Chen, I think, is her eBay name. I'll put the link if you want to get some more of the, um, some of these down below. But let's go ahead and open this up because these are very, very cool. And obviously, Lego does not have anything like this, okay? Um, I can tell you that 100%, okay? So here we go. First, we got our little base plate, okay? We'll put him down there. Let's get our body set up. Now, this is obviously going to be a barbarian. One of the barbarians in the game. If you guys play the game, you'll know that you can uh, build your army by training them and everything. And the training of them, you can do... Once you upgrade your, your, your training or your um, base and your barracks you can actually start training these guys now the cool thing about these is that they're flesh toned which you don't really see in lego that often because lego is yellow now right off the bat legs are stiff which i like this arm is stiff okay but this arm's a little loose okay not too much where it's a problem but it's just to let you know now if you could see the tampos you can see they're actually pretty nice. They're, he's got his little toes right there. Um, and he's got his loincloth. Obviously he's wearing no shirt. Uh, this is kind of funny because it kind of goes with what I'm watching right now on Netflix. Uh, Spartacus, which is definitely not for kids. It's for adults. But uh, that's what I've been watching lately. So this kind of goes in together. It's familiar. All right, and here's his face, which is great. Now... The thing that makes it hilariously cool, though, is that he's got his hel his helmet hair, which I thought was awesome. So, and then let's see, he's got his battle sword, okay? Because what they do is they come in, you, you make, these are the cheapest um, uh, characters to train in the, uh, the game. Oh look, they give you an extra arm. That's cool. And so basically a lot of times you'll just, whoops, you'll just build a bunch of these guys so they can just overrun um, the fort and every, or the various uh, installations you go after. Now the thing, now there we go. See that arm just popped off. So the thing, thing I'm noticing about this guy is that some of the things don't pop or stay in, so. Are they as sure fitting as Lego? Yes and no. Um, but there's my first barbarian. And now there's no building directions, so I don't know what I'm doing right or what I'm doing wrong. I'm just going off of what I know as far as how the figure's supposed to look. So that's that. I I don't know what these things are. Maybe you maybe you build something um, like a some kind of like a maybe a weapons holder I guess but it's Lego you can do whatever you want okay that's that's a gold piece by the way if in case you're wondering so all right so let's put him over there
so now we have just what another barbarian now um, this one is actually my, I don't think he's actually really different but I think his weapon is so let's check this out let's put him yeah tempos are the same toes are the same um, if you guys remember, I got a uh, Dragon Ball Z set from uh, the same company makes them. Now this one, both arms are stiff, so that's kind of cool. Uh, and one thing I noticed is I got a, I got the wrong pieces on uh, one of my figures. They gave me two left arms, so this one is actually looking so far to be correct. Okay. So let's put his head on. Oh, and check it out. His head is actually, his face is different, which is really cool. He's kind of got this frazzled, scared look in his eyes. He's not as angry and hard as that guy. So, all right. And then his shield is actually gold, which is cool. So we'll put... We'll put the shield. We'll just have him holding it like this. And then we have his sword. Can't have a barbarian without a sword. And he'll be like, what? We'll put him on his little plate. And we'll put him down there. Okay, so. Again, there we go. Very cool. Uh, so far, I'm really happy with this minifigure set. Um, no issues whatsoever. Let's build the, this little thing. I don't know what this thing is for. I think you put your weapon or your shield on it. Um, and guess what? They gave me another arm for free. Alright, so let's put that right. Well, I gotta move his arm up. So there we go put that right there too all right so that's two the next one up is the next one to purchase uh, when you train your troops and that is the archer she is the next one that's uh, fairly inexpensive I think these guys are 25 uh, elixir points these girls are 50 elixir points if I'm correct correct me if I'm wrong but let's go ahead and put her together um, pretty easy to put put the arms and, and pieces together even though they're very small again I'm, I'm digging the flesh tone colored skin colored pieces so that's very cool so we got her in let's see what her face looks like oh look she's got that girl she's got a really girly 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 looking face with freckles I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, freckles and everything. That's cool. <laughs> That's she's kind of bald at the Sinead O'Connor ring right now. But let's give her hair. That's cool. She's a ponytail. And then let's give her her bow and arrow. Okay. Now again, these are very cool because they they do run very. Ah, oh, wait a minute. Hold on. So not only that, but look, there's a quiver. <gasps> Whoa, that's cool. Okay, so let's put that around her neck. That is awesome. Okay. And then we have her on. There we go. Put her little head on. Dude, whoops. I mean, put her little hair on. So cool. Now, this should actually be technically this should be on the inside I don't know if it'll fit though yeah I don't think it will but there she is very cool all right so far this uh, this set is proven to be pretty cool all right and you know we won't we won't we don't have to build each stand let's just Let's just take these pieces and put them over there. Uh, this one did not give me a free extra hand. Actually, it didn't give me any free extra pieces. So, that's that.
Alright, the next one up is the next cheap guy, and he is the Goblin. Now, uh, these guys can take a beating. Uh, the archers can't really, because they're not really armored. They don't have any shields or anything. And these guys can't take a beating either, because they're just bearskin with no shield, I believe. However, they move very fast. So when you're looting, um, once you send the barbarians in and the archers in, you're most likely going to lose those guys. And there they are. Look at that creepy face. You're most likely going to lose those guys. And then you send these guys in with maybe a, bar, uh, a giant uh, who's already in there who's distracting all the cannons and stuff. And then they run in and they loot... Uh, the things too. Now they have a sword. Um, however, I don't see the sword in here. So that's one thing that stinks. No weapon. However, they do have their little satchel of stuff. So that's cool. Let's see. Sorry guys, I'm using the screen to build all these guys so that you guys can see um, what it all looks like as I'm building. There we go. Whoops, his head, his ears just popped off. And the cool thing is he's also tiny. So in the game, he's also like kind of small. So they gave him chopped legs. So there we go. You might remember these from The Hobbit. Uh, Bilbo Baggins and they use them for kids a lot of time. Now, I don't know what this is. Do you? Are these just gold rings or what? I I don't know. If you know what this is, let me know. Okay. They did give you gold piece, the stand, and everything. Um, and an extra foot or an extra hand. So, let's, let's see him right here. Whoa. Very cool. All right. So good job, China. Um, so far for bootleg figure minifigures, these are great. Again, five bucks. Five bucks with free shipping. All right, the next one up. Oh wait, 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 wait. I'm, I was wrong. They did give me an extra fit a hand for the archer. I just didn't pull it out of the bag. The next one up is another one who is pretty cool. He's also, I think, in wave. Tier 3 is when you can actually arm up. He's actually really expensive because he is uh, a bomb. He's a, basically a suicidal bomber. And there's his body. He's a skeletal bomber. They call them uh, wall breakers. That's what they call them. Okay. Um, and then let's see. Let's get his legs on. Oh wait, no, those aren't his legs. These are his legs. Look at those little feet. All right. <laughs> and these are his arms. Okay. So the skeletal ones, they don't bend. Um, they don't have a bend. They're just straight armed. But they're still really cool. Um, I think this one should be this way. There we go. No. Hmm. Yeah, I think I think I got it right the first time. So let's put him back on. There we go. All right. Whoa. Okay. So that's his arm. That's the skeletal guy. His thing is a pack of dynamite. See. Because he's a wall breaker, and what he does is he runs to the wall and tries to blow him up, or a cannon, or whatever. But again, these guys are expensive, they're not cheap. Um, also, uh, these guys in the game have a little hat. However, they didn't include the hat here, so. Alright, there's that one. Now, the last figure in the set is one that I do not have yet because I don't have enough experience in the game. I just started playing so 
I don't have enough experience to, and yet to get him. But this is the wizard. And as you can see, he's pretty cool. He's got the tempos for the wizard in the game. There's that distinct face that he has. And then there's his like shroud. The shroud of wizardry. Yeah. Now I'm gonna leave the shroud off because I gotta put his arms on, so. So what do you guys think of this so far? Do you guys even play the video game? That's my next question is. Um, Cause if you do, you know how addicting it is. It is basically a sim game. So you just create things and you create worlds and then um, people start to battle you. Like I know when I first started, I kept getting attacked by random people and I would constantly be killed or my village would be destroyed. But lately I've been uh, doing better on my defenses, so now I'm winning. So and there's his, those are his fireballs. Now, I again, I don't have him yet, so I have no idea what his ability is. But I'm guessing it's the ability to shoot fire. Now, it would have been cool if the Chinese company included a cape. But no cape, okay? Just an extra arm. And uh, those other pieces with gold to be built. All right, so there you have it. So let me go ahead and put these, let me put these guys in order so that you guys know what, what we're getting. All right, so there you have it. There is my Clash of Clans um, build video, review and build video. I hope you like what you see. Uh, again, I am still gonna build the top three uh, other videos first. This isn't, um, this, is, this just wasn't in the original selection, so. And again, like I said, I play this game a lot, so I wanted to play this, uh, I wanted to show it to you. I will also try to do some gameplay for you guys to see uh, at the end of this video, so stay tuned, okay? Thanks again for watching. Give me a questions and comments down below. Thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. All right, guys, bye-bye.